here at Alta Mesa visiting my mom and cleaning her stuff. The first step was to dig around, get all the grass out. And the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna pour some vinegar on the sides. This will help kill any weeds. Used to clean the stone with this same solution, substituting the peroxide with vinegar. It does absolutely clean the stone, but in the long run, it's gonna start tearing into the granite. Here at Alta Mesa, they use well water to water the grass. It's adding all this water stains onto it, and of course, build up. So that's what we're trying to clean off here. But before I add the solution on it, I'm gonna go ahead and just lightly clean the stone. I'm just gonna use a little bit of dish soap just to get a first layer off. We are gonna make a solution. I'm going to add one cup of baking soda, five teaspoons of any liquid soap. Dawn is always my favorite to use. And then I'm gonna use the peroxide to just make it into like a consistency of yogurt. And that's what we're gonna spread all over the granite. It's been over 24 hours since we put the solution on. I'm going to start cleaning it. Basically, all you're going to need is the brush and fresh water since Alta Mesa has the well water, and then some towels to wipe it down and to buff it out later. A granite and marble cleaner cleans and polishes in one step, which is what we want it to do. Hi, so this is the finished stone. As you can see, it's totally clean, dug around, has her Mother's Day flowers. Of course, I know that my mom is in heaven. So this pretty much is therapeutic for us kids to come here and kind of just slow down enough to remember all the wonderful things that they have taught us, 
the many sacrifices that they have made for our family. And I honor her, praise God for her, and I'm happy one day I'll be with her. Love you, Mom. Happy Mother's Day. We are here. We. This is my older sister, Annie. Uh, this is a clean with me video. And I know most of you are blessed to have your moms with you. My mom is deceased. Tomorrow will be 18 years since we've lost our mom to cancer. But we wanted to wish you all a happy Mother's Day. And for those who are still blessed to have their moms, go ahead and hug them extra tight tomorrow. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for organization, cleaning, makeup tutorials, and just some encouragement on any journey that you're on in your life. All right. Bye. Bye. Annie, could you read out what it says, please? Okumonu ia, ai pekia, oku pekia, i he eki, koe uhi, mihe, naunga hinga ue, vea okumuimu.